Right then, welcome back. Uh, yes, back on the live races. I'm sure that I will live to regret it. Um, we're at the Nürburgring GP circuit, five laps, uh, part of the Euro Naked Trophy event. And we are going to use the 2019 MV Augusta Brutale 1000 Serie Oro. It is... <sighs> It's a little bit feisty from what I remember. Um, it's not... Not the nicest thing in the world to use. But... Um, it's quite quick. Uh, quite rude. Um, I'm going to do a 2 and 8. I'm going to run a medium front soft... Hmm, soft rear? Yeah, why not? Soft rear. It's quite a long lap, so it might wear itself out. Um, we'll do the race. Um, and then we'll go and have a little shot at the leaderboards because I'm hoping that this is going to push the Street 5 V4S a little bit more than some of the other naked bikes. It probably won't, but we won't know unless we try. Ah, oh, everyone's falling off. Well done. Well done. Yeah, brakes aren't great. We'll try engine brake in three. Oh, what on earth? There we go, there we go. Wonder why it felt a bit... a bit lacking. Um, it also doesn't want to turn in and it likes to wheelie. So we're going to drop that front preload to one. I'm going to drop the spring hardness on the rear to one and I'm going to drop the rebound to slow it down coming back up because I don't want it bouncing about. Um, I'm also tempted. Mind you, we're going to use any regular level three, so we'll go with that for now. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. We're going to get it stopped, we're going to get it stopped, we're going to get it stopped. Just. Oh my god. Unless you are perfect with your inputs on the stick, it'll either stand up like that. Oh my god. 16th, Jesus. Oh my god. The AI haven't been too bad and then all of a sudden we get here and they're just usual carnage of showing the throttle when you get near them and What a start. Oh, but we're on the outside. I don't like being on the outside. Asking for trouble. Oh, 
that's the only problem with that engine brake in three. If you're a little late off the gas and you've got it lent over, it pulls all kinds of funny shapes. got a bit of a window where it likes to operate. Push beyond that becomes a massive handful. Kicking, bucking, weaving. It's not good. Oh, he's bend it. Absolutely bend it. That was always going to happen, wasn't it? Right, well. I guess we just don't have to fall off. Missing your breaking point into that first corner is not a good way to do it. down to a 56 Breaking three is not nice at all. I wonder if we can trim it out with a bit more, a bit more spring rate on the front. Oh, oh, that was a bit rude. Good through there, that's the weird thing. It's horrible around the whole lap, apart from that last chicane. Right, we'll try engine braking two again. This could send that front medium. Absolutely through the roof temperature-wise. But it should give us a bit, a bit of a bigger window with the braking in and through the corners, so... Let's just use a bit of rear brake, which we couldn't do on engine brake in three, so... It's got to make a conscious effort to get on the brakes that little bit earlier. Certainly a lot smoother. Oh, 
just scary through there. it's got I think a bit more front spring right should give us a bit more support and that should push a bit of weight rearwards and hopefully stop this kind of wheelie sliding weird it's almost like R1-ish It's a bit easier to hustle. That engine brake can turn down a notch. Oh my god, is that 54? Oh, 55 1. So if we can sort the handling out, then we should, we should get into the 54s. Right then, time attack. So we did a one, a one fifty five point one eight two, um, one fifty two point six. Oh my good lord, two point two and a half seconds. That is a lot of time to find, especially just by playing with the front suspension. We'll give it a go. Right, one fifty five point one eight two. It's like seventieth, fifty five. 0.182 would have put 79th. That's 79th again. I'm sure it was 79th the other day. Um, so we've set 78th as the target. 152.6. That is obscene. Is there another MV? Because that will be a more realistic target, wouldn't it? No. No. It's BMWs and Yamahas everywhere. Odd Aprilia. No MVs. Well, top 100, unless I've missed it, not a single MV. Oh well. Oh well, no pressure. I guess we've got to beat that Street Fighter then. We also need to set ourselves a limit of, say, 10 laps, because I can get very, very, very carried away with these. Um, and it just ends up, I spend longer doing these than I do at the actual races themselves. So a Chuono, which is very similar in performance to us, 882, that's 881. The V4 1100 factory is in a 154.9. That's only two tenths quicker. Yeah, that's super naked. It's way out front, isn't it? Jesus. Way out front. Okay, set up. The front end needs a bit more support, for sure. So we'll bump that up to full. The back end is still, for me, mucking about um, and kind of stepping sideways so I'm going to slow the compression and increase the rebound I'm going to reverse what I did before just to see if that makes a difference uh, transmission's fine, calibrations will go aggressive, tyres I think we'll go medium soft and 
think the medium will be okay. I think it might cook the soft because we've pumped the front suspension up, so that'll move a load of energy into the back tyre. So we'll do a few laps and see how that soft rear gets on. But yeah, 155.163 for starters, and then we'll see where we go from there. Oh, it's scary. Still scary through there. Come on, stop, 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 stop. Yep, thank you. Feed that off a little bit. Oh, 54-0. Right, let's go back to the pit. Put a hard front tyre on. Jesus. Jesus, what we're down to? 154.0. So I've got 1.4 seconds to get to that Ducati. <laughs> Get off that curve. It kind of gets hooked on that and it won't come off. Oh, we're not far away. Come on, get in. Thank you. That's used a massive amount of rear brake there. Clean, come on, let's have that. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> There's me thinking we were on something really good. Three hundred so. Okay, though. We're getting closer to the 52s. We just have to admit defeat. We just have to admit defeat at a 153.2. That's what I'll do. I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry when we go back and have a look at this time. We'll have a look at the setup first, though. Right, there you go. Setup wise, uh, we looked at anti wheelie 2, engine braking 2, no traction. We're on hard front and a soft rear. Um, not really a lot else I could have done with it. To be fair, it was just um, one of those weird times where there was obviously spare time on the table um, but I just couldn't find anything I think I need to go to a few more tracks like Kyle Army, Portimao um, possibly Imola and just have a little play with it and see where it wants to make its time up and where it doesn't um, it's quick, it is quick I mean we've only finished a handful of tenths off of that Street Fighter so it sounds a lot but if you were to do them side by side it would be an absolutely minuscule amount of, uh, of distance. Oh, 153.0. A 153.0. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought. I thought it was going to be into the 52s. And if it's into the 52s, then there was always going to be a little bit of a chance we could find those couple of tenths of a second. 153.247. It's not bad.
Right, after doing an endurance race at the Nurburg GP circuit, uh, what did we do? 153.247. It would have, <coughs> excuse me, it would have put us 23rd. The 153.0 would have put us 19th, I think. It's so close. So very close at the top of there. I mean, all right, Mia cats away with the fairies and a 149. Oh, what now? How are you 1.4 seconds faster than everybody else? I don't get it. I don't. Where is that 1.4 seconds? And that is, what, 49, 50, 51, 52. That's 3.3 seconds quicker than we went on that Brutale. If you know where that 3.3 seconds is, could you please tell me or show me and do me a video? Because that was absolutely ridiculous. But okay, we're done. Finish with this one. Uh, next time out, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what we're going to do. We'll go to the Asia events. Um, we've done all the two strokes. There's none of them left to do. Um, we are probably looking at. Hmm. Now, for some reason, 81 to 93 naked. It says Ducati Monster 900, but we'll have to have a check on that. But you never know. It's either that or. A 2005 Suzuki GSX-R600. It's one or the other. But anyway, this is done. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting, liking, subscribing, all of the usual jazz. Um, and fingers crossed I'll see you next time. Take care, stay safe. Peace.